The River State Chapter of the National Youth Council of Nigeria, NYCN, says it has secured a partnership with foreign investors to train Rivers youth on entrepreneurial skills. According to them, the Rivers youth will be trained on modernized spraying and painting of houses, still work amongst other programs during the training. Leading a delegation to the State Secretariat of the NYCN in Port Harcourt, the executive director of the steel company from the Netherlands, Jan Mattel, said many Nigerian youths, particularly from Lagos State, have benefited from the training and have been sent to the Netherlands for refresher training. Speaking on behalf of the investors in charge of the painting training, Emmanuel Daivan emphasized the importance of the skill acquisition training to the youth in boosting the state economy. The benefits are enormous. Uh, we are going to be helping introducing them into entrepreneurship. We are going to be helping them um, be contributors to the river state economy because when this, when they start off with this, um, they will become entrepreneurs themselves. They will become employers of labor themselves. They will also be able to network within themselves. So um, we believe that this is a collaboration that is not only going to help the youth, but it's also going to help. The, the state and the economy of Niger Delta as a whole. Chairman of the National Youth Council of Nigeria in River State, Tijoke Nhuwa said the choice of River State for the training point clarifies that the state is safe for investors. For us, we have partnership with you and uh, we're going to talk uh, with uh, the Minister of Development who is also supervising us to see how uh, we we'll partner with your company to get some youth out of the streets. Uh, we seventy percent of our youth even in the country are on the streets, so they must have something doing. I want to thank you for coming and being assured that uh, this is a starting point, and that we have a governor that is very uh, friendly with the youth and represents young people. So I want to partner with the state government to see how we even train more than one person per local government. The beneficiaries are expected to be drawn from the twenty-three local government areas of River State.